Okay, guys, today I'm going to show you how to get custom keyboards on your iPod Touch. They don't, if you're thinking it's the keyboards, you only get a certain amount. Like, I have this, and I have a clicking sound for a black, I'm going Blackberry right now. So, I know you can't hear it, but I think it's pretty cool. So, no, oh, hold on, I'm trying to do the Sony Vegas thing, but whatever. Alright, so... Just go to Cydia. It's letting me just click continue real quick. Okay. Sorry. I'm doing stuff. See, I sometimes hate Cydia, but whatever. Okay, so, go away. Okay, so you're just going to click on search and type in I access. And click search. And then I access for English, and then they it has a little question mark, whatever. So after you do that, then you have all these different keyboards down here. You have like MacBook, um, I'll download MacBook Air, I like that one. Just install it. Confirm it. <laughs> and thank you for watching this if you are. I don't know why I said that right now. Bored, I guess. Then you just exit out. It doesn't need to reload. Yeah, it's slow. It's a bad thing about jailbreaking. That's what I hate about it. Winterboard. Then, then what's it called? I just un uncheck some stuff. Uncheck and just oh god. Okay, it's respringing. So, you guys can skip if you want to, because I'm pretty sure it might take a minute. So, um, I don't know, just skip a couple if, um, so, sorry about that. Can't pause it on Camtasia. Stop. I don't want to really stop it, because, whatever. Okay, it's almost done. Just the screen just dimmed, so it should be here any second. All right, here it is. And let me just let it say connect on my iPod. Okay, hold on. Okay. Here it is. Okay. Now, if you've already done it, see, I, st I have a different keyboard. So, it's MacBook Air keyboard. And it's really cool. So, that's pretty much what I, and you can just have to go to Winterboard and respring every time. That's all. Thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful day.